With endless white sandy beaches and a majestic coastline, it's easy to see why Cape Town has become one of the world's top tourism destinations. But that's largely in summer. In winter, it's a very different story. Cloudy skies, rain and cold temperatures often scare off visitors, making the season a very unproductive one for the sector. Tourism authorities, though, have identified certain measures that may help in driving up visitor numbers during the off-peak season. To grow the sector further, we have an action plan um, which includes improved air access, which makes it easier for people to come to the province, and then also increasing business tourism. Um, so these are some of the initiatives that we have in place. That might go a long way to help alleviate a slow winter season where key tourism attractions are often empty and tourism spend is at its lowest. There are some countries, though, that are increasingly showing a propensity for travel to the Western Cape during the winter months which has been seen as a saving grace for over 200,000 people employed in the local tourism industry. We are seeing strong growth in bookings between April and September. Um, that's usually our quiet period. We're seeing an increase from visitors in China, the United States of America, as well as Europe. And the temperatures in the Western Cape, um, it has a fairly high average temperature during winter, which will attract visitors from colder areas. And then at the same time, it's also a draw card for visitors from areas which experience very hot weather during this time of the year. New airlines have also added routes into Cape Town recently, which are slowly growing the inbound numbers, but some feel much more is needed. When it rains, it pours. That's a general feeling amongst tourism stakeholders who believe the winter season has a terrible effect on business. The winter season is very, very bad because the tourists come from their countries and they want to experience a different weather and it's as cold as cold as can be when they come here. So we have less tourists. In winter, um, generally quieter, less money gets been made. So the staff also don't work. So we all have to stay at home. Business is not as good as it is in the summer months. Definitely is not. Uh, winter is a lot quieter. It's colder, uh, it doesn't attract as many Europeans as we would in the summer. It's not all economic gloom though. A recent oyster festival in the province attracted some 70,000 visitors and added 3,000 jobs. And an upcoming international AIDS conference is sure to bring over some new visitors as well. Ravs Andrews, CCTV, Cape Town.